saw a discovery during the maple tapping adventure this year. Life is a winding road No telling where it goes Driving through days and nights So it is time to tap our trees. And it's only like February 11th, so that's super early. Last year I think we did it in March, but um, we kind of fell behind this season and we actually missed out on maybe up to a couple weeks because it was so dang early and we just weren't ready. Chris is grabbing his tool belt. Then he's going to open up some packages that, that just arrived. I think we ordered some more buckets. We are doing a whole new system this year, new buckets, new taps, um, taps with pipe to the buckets. Just because last year it was very last minute and unplanned, this year we wanted to have more of a solid plan that was going to be more effective. So let's go tap the trees. It's cold, but not that cold. It's like 37 degrees. Where do you want to start? Uh, let's start in the back. Okay. Let's, uh, I'm gonna grab, I'm gonna bring the stuff out there and put it in the cart and we'll use the cart to move around. Oh, the gorilla cart? Yeah. Come on! Here she comes! <laughs> They're so fun. I love the barn cat so much. Oh my gosh! Is that just like a giant ice chunk? All pets to the fork. <laughs> that looks ridiculous. Hi, Bezel. So, is there anything else in there? Ew. Gross water. Goat poop. Goat poop. Yum. Hi, Sage. Come on. So where'd you get these buckets? Um, these are from Home Depot again, but they're a slightly different brand than what we used last time. Okay. I believe. Just a food grade. They're a little cheaper online. Food grade, like dollar bucket? Dollar bucket. How expensive are they? Uh, a few dollars. Okay. Three, three something. How bucket. much did you spend on the materials? Total for everything? Yeah. It's only about 50, 60 dollars, I think. Oh, that's not, not bad. Not including the evaporator supplies. Those are more expensive. But. Oh. Okay. Yeah. Let's Let's go. What do we need to do? We need to load up. That was easy. Look at look at the base. You got Sage coming over. Sagey, hi. Okay, so we're gonna start back there in those trees, then we'll make our way forward. How many buckets do we have? Ten. Okay, so ten trees to start with. Yeah. Or ten taps. Okay. I really want to know, really want to know If I will ever figure out That's sad. Well, we lost one of our large maple trees, guys. I think it was dying. So sad. Sad. I don't think we can put tree. that. I know, that was our biggest chapter. Maybe, oh well. So we went out I think in October or November before the trees had lost all their leaves and we marked some uh, maple trees to tap. So we got these two right here. Um, I think they're red maples. One's pretty big. The other one's small, but at least a foot in diameter. So we're gonna tap both of these guys and we'll show you guys. And if you want to see what we did last year, we have a whole video about that. I'm going to link it down below so you can watch our first maple tapping experiment and experience. It wasn't really that experimental. No, we all? never tapped that one. So you want me to start here? Yeah, south side. Okay. Even if I'm falling down, I will keep on searching for my highs. Say I lost my mind, I will keep on holding my head high Even if the sky is falling down no. Where are you, Sap? Come on, ow! Wait, what? Oh, there it is! Jumping from cliff 
lift so high Trust in our wings to fly Sometimes we're crashing down But we get up and start from the ground Keep on searching for my highs You can say I lost my mind I will keep on Should be good So cool So cool uh, this to, to do the bucket? So cool this produced our sugar needs I know Yes Okay get that bucket under there So I don't list, miss out on all the sap coming out I know it's like a tiny tiny bit compared to What it would be but Is that all you need is just one little hole? That's all I need. The pipe will fit in there? I'll show you. This little doodad will fit in there. The cat's Basil's hunting sage behind you. They're so cute. They're very cute. Come here guys! Come hang out with us! Goes. You see it coming out the tube? I think so. Yeah, see it's filling up the tube. First one done. You guys enjoy this process too? Weren't they with us last time we did this? Probably. <laughs> and then you angle it up just a little bit? Just a very slight bit, yeah. It like doesn't this? be crazy. Yeah, that's fine. Just keep, it, just keep it straight as you go. And back out to bring out. Yeah, so just to get the wood chips out as you go. So like this just goes. Yeah, make sure you're hitting the hammer straight on. It'll make it easier to go in. And you don't have to hit it too far. Like once you start getting some resistance in it and you wiggle it and it feels pretty tight. Good. Yeah, it's good. Oh my gosh. Same thing, you got all the one all the sides but one this side. Oh my goodness, what are you doing up there? Hey, what are you doing up there? I can do it. She's so cute. Just look up, she's looking in the trees. As far as you can get it, over the first lip, ideally. Yeah, that's probably pretty good. Okay. Unless you feel like you can get it further. All the way down to here now. Oh, really? That's yeah. cool. And then on this one, it's already, it's already, already like six inches. Come back in. Knock yeah, don't you knock that out of the tree, you punkos. Punkos. Hey. Okay, next, next tree. Let's get this one. This one is our big producer. Already dripping. I can hear it. Yeah. But so fast. Okay, let's, let's go inside. Okay. I'm falling over. Okay, so we did three trees. Four trees. Well, three trees, four taps. Yeah. Three trees, four taps. We've got at least 
Six more taps to go. But at least how many? This tree is not going to be one of them. Sad discovery during the maple tapping adventure this year. Send me off with the words of a lullaby.